morning everyone, welcome back to my channel, I hope you're all well. Today I thought I would film a wee makeup look for you, I'm trying out the Sephora um, Colour Fill Celestial Glitter Eye Palette, this is in the shade 500. I did actually film this already but unfortunately the footage, I couldn't upload it so I'm re-filming. So that's what it looks like there, it's like green, gold, blue. Nice colour shift tip. So the first thing I'm going to do is go in with some Brow Atelier uh, Defy Brow Styling Soap. And that's what it looks like there. So you just apply a wee bit of water or Fix Plus tip. I'll do a wee bit of Fix Plus. And I'll just use a wee spoolie that comes out. Sometimes they're alright, sometimes they're not. Pop a wee onto the brush. If you see me, see me looking down here, it's because my mirror's down here. I'm going to let that dry down and then we'll go in with another product. So for skin I'm going to go in with the Garnier Ambre Solaire 50 Plus Hydra 24 Protect. Screen Protect, the yeah. sun protector for your skin. Or protector for your skin, should I say. No sun protector. Protection for your skin against the UV rays. So how is everybody? I hope you're all good. Have you been up to anything exciting? So for brows, we're going to go in with the uh, uh, Evelyn Cosmetics uh, Micro Brow Pencil. And this is in the shade Soft Brown. A wee spoolie and then a wee micro thing tip. Just to fill in a wee bit of the gaps. What a beautiful day that is the day outside. It's really sunny. Shorts and t-shirt day of the day. Has anybody got any nice plans? I'm going to go out the back and enjoy the sunshine after this. I'm never going to get the two of them relief in because this one obviously has the mad scar. Next I'm going to go in with some concealer. This is the multi Multitask Concealer by Rimmel and it's in the shade 030 Light. I'm just going to pop some of this under my brows. Just to try and clean them up a wee bit and to hide these dark circles in the corners. We'll go in with a flat-ish brush. I 
That's actually maybe a bit too much. I'm just going to go in and release sponge. So for eyeshadow, I'm going to go in with this Revolution palette. And I'm just going to use a brown in this one. This is the Revolution Matte Neutrals Eyeshadow Palette. Intense Pigment Matte Shadows. So I'm going to go in with this brown right at the bottom here. And just pop that in my crease. That is pretty pigmented, isn't it? Same thing on the other eye. Hope everybody's getting out for some nice walks and enjoying the sunshine while it lasts. Hopefully we'll have a good few weeks of nice sunshine, that'd be nice. So for the shadow, I'm just going to go in and pick this up on my finger because I felt like it applied better the first time i done it. So I'm just going to pop my finger and give it a wee swirl. And it looks blue and green in my finger and a wee bit gold it's coming off kind of blue green on the other side it's actually gold I think I was expecting a bit more for this palette this uh, palette I'm not worried about underneath, I can clean one that up. I've just got a wee wipe here, I'm just going to wipe my finger off. You might put it on you. I'm just going to go back in with that wee brush again in the same colour. Just to blend that egg, blend that egg. Put on the outer corner. Next, we're going to go in with some Maybelline Sky High mascara in the shade black. anybody else tried this what do they think of this mascara do you like it 
do you not like it? I think it's okay. Definitely gives me length. And a wee bit lift. So today I'm going to go in with a BB by Marcel BB Cream Golden Glow Skin Enhancer. I'm just going to go over it with a wee sponge. And then I'm going to grab some concealer and pop it under my eyes. Looks like it's creasing and it looks pretty dry. Same thing. Now for bronzer I've got the Primark Cream Contour. New techniques, buffing brush. Put it on the forehead. bronzer I've got the Revolution bronzer in the shade bronzer kiss 
just for powdered one. In fact, for blush, we're going to go in with a uh, made by Mitchell Liquid Blusher in the shade Toasted Terracotta. Pop a wee bit of that on. Don't know if that'll be enough, but we'll try. We can try. Like it's kind of patchy. God. Start looking really bad. Oh well, hopefully some powder will cover it up. Let's see. Right, so for bronzer, we're going to go in with the powder bronzer. And this is a Fairy Revolution Initiate Bronzer Kiss. Um, I'm just going to use this fluffy angle brush. There's no name on this one. A bit on the forehead. And then the cheeks. That looks really harsh. Really bad and it's grabbing right like right here. Oh well, they live and learn, don't they? See what works, see what doesn't work. So for powder blusher, I'm going to go in with the Primark one. This is in the shade True Peach. I'm just going to use this fluffy uh, blush brush by Real Techniques. How harsh that side looks. Wow. Right, let's see if we can get a fluffier brush and turn that down a wee bit. So for lips, we're going to go in with the Elf Lip Liner, Elf Cream Glide Lip Liner. And this is in the shade Spill the Tea. I was super impressed with this when I tried it the other day. Really, really creamy. I think it's the first elf one I've ever tried. In this range anyway. And for lipstick, we're going to go in with the Wet n Wild, and this is in the shade Never Nude. It's a paler nude than the lip liner. Very creamy. I actually like them as well. Don't know how much stir uh, power. Stay they've got or last in power they've got, I'm not very sure. Probably not very much. <coughs> Next, I'm going to put in some Max FX Plus. Cool myself down in this weather. So, some items did not turn out alright. I'm not really happy with the blush, but that's fine. The eyelashes, I could not get on, but that's okay. Practice, practice, practice. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll look forward to seeing you in my next one. If you have any comments, suggestions for videos or anything you'd like me to film, 
just write it in the comment section down below. If you haven't subscribed already, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. Share it, like, comment and subscribe. And enjoy the lovely weather, guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Bye, everybody.